<laughs> You've got to seriously. I'm genuinely worried. You're about addicted you. to that. You're addicted to I that. I can stop whenever I want. Oh, that's what everyone says. I can stop whenever I want. That's what everyone it says. It just it's a minty. It's a per. It's mint. It gets you. Okay, makes me feel good. Let Your me sinuses are gonna start bleeding. No, no. Yeah. No, they don't. Yeah, they. I'm gonna get like all that. Like you're gonna get all snotted up and stuff. No, I'm not. It's just me clear. You actually, you're dripping a little. I can't believe that you're you're shoving that thing like halfway up your sinus. And last episode, you handed it to Freddie Wong and let him invest it. And he did it. And he did it. No, he didn't touch it. He didn't touch it. He he went like that. Okay. Yeah. But still, the fact that he let it get close. Yeah. And he was like, "Man, that's a strong, pungent smell of." of because you're fucking listen, dribbling. I mean, and, it's, dribbling. and it's not it's not unhealthy or anything. It's just He's some mental. It's smelling your smel- brain. He's it just smells a little minty, a minty, fresh substance. My God. And I feel fine. What is that black? What is that? Your head gray is filled with ants. <laughs> is that gray sludge? I feel like shit. Oh, I feel good. Hey, everybody. Welcome to Chuckle Sandwich. It's a very special episode, everyone. It's a very, very big episode. Probably one of the biggest episodes that we've ever had Don't in the history. Don't do this. <laughs> <laughs> so, so insulting. Uh, I'm sorry. Um, we've got um, our good friend, em- Emma. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Oh, no. Ooh. La- L- Longevin. No. Not bad. Better than most people. I, well, because no. No. there was Land a challenge that you posted no. on Twitter at one point for Fuck. people to, you know, phonetically spell out, and I messed it up a couple times. Yeah. But then I, re- I remember you saying that it's like half the French one and then half the like American one, sp- pronouncing it literally. How do you yeah. pronounce it actually? I say Langevin. Langevin. But oh, apparently, okay. like most like French Canadians, because it's a French Canadian last name, apparently that's fucking wrong, and fucking they always tell me people. that. Mm. Yeah. They always come They're down really to Florida. You ever go to Florida and you see a bunch of Quebec license plates? And you're like, what are you doing? How'd you get down here? Doing here? That shit says like Jim Van. Did you, like there, did you, did you take a big goal? Like, how did you? Know. And they're all old know. people, and they can't drive, and yeah. they just sit out there and bake. Yeah. To my understanding, all Canadians like shrivel up and die if they don't have snow within a 10 meter radius of them. So I don't even understand how they got down there. Well, they, they do like that. They're always in their the speedos too. They're yeah. always wearing an alarmingly oh, like yeah. minimal amount of clothing. Yeah, what is with the Canadian speedos? What are they trying to prove? Yeah. You know. That they've got, like, they can show their cocks out. Like, I mean, it's not impressive. And that, yeah. They just got bigger bulges on Americans, I guess. Now, hold on. So what's going on here? <laughs> now, hold on. Shlai, you look confused, man. I'm just thinking of how we could test that You're just theory. thinking of... Could, I don't think get a bunch should, of men together. I don't think that we should just... Like a b- big group of Yeah. I mean, the snow... <laughs> I don't feel like we need this, because we need the control. So <laughs> no some, snow. No, no just snow. Just no even snow, right here. Because the snow, because it's, it's cold, then, you know, you're getting altered data. Yeah. <laughs> it, Altered data. Well, yeah, because then you've got the. You've <laughs> that is got true. you got to take shrivel. into account shrinkage. Yeah. You've got yeah. you to account for this. Big, yep. yeah. And Back honestly, trip. the French are probably used. The French Canadians, colder up there, they probably have adapted to that. Yeah, the blood flow stays. Yeah, so, so they we'll stay ke- plump. What you, know what I, you know what I call this, Schlepp? <laughs> you, know you know what I call wow. this? I call this solving for P. That's funny, man. That's good. It's good. Yeah. It's good. Pound I can tell because uh, we have a live studio audience, and so far over the course of both of these episodes, none of them have made a single, single. Se- oh, I got an exhale. There was an exhale through the nose from Weston. Curry. Thank you, Weston Curry. Thank you, man. Um, My number one fan. So you- back to our theory, we get a bunch of like fifty, 50 guys. Fifty yeah. guys. 50 Do you guys, know how many uh, people fifty is? That's a lot of people. 50. That's gonna fill up this whole room. It's literally just gonna be a bunch Wait, of Wait, so hot like, so so like twenty five American and twenty five French Canadian yeah. or yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, and they're yeah. all like speaking their language. Yeah, we line snow, it up. No, we snow. get a camera at waist <laughs> level and we just have it pan. <laughs> we just have it pan across all the bulges. Yeah. And sort of maybe we just I don't know, kinda like like they do in the Olympics. Like we, we give a rating of bulge size, shape. Quality? I feel like the Olympics ratings are so hard too, because if you see someone do something that you think is impressive, like right away, you're like yeah. ten, and, and the next guy one ups it, and you're like, I can't backpedal. Yeah, like nine point five. You know what I mean? Yeah. I wonder if it'd be the same thing with yeah, fucking it always, it always sucks going first. You know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. When did you? Um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that got a laugh. Something of of no substance. What's like the beginning of the potential of things? I, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> did you actually have something to say, or did you? No, you, I like I wanted to get out of there, but I didn't have like enough to, and I was yeah. just like, whatever, dude. I mean, like we'll stay here however long. Emma, when did you? Yeah. <laughs> when did I what? When did you? And the, and. When did I? 
if yeah. you have to eye. choose between, you know, and the obvious, the thing, you know, the elephant in the room, what would it be? I mean. That's good. What would it be? You ever like. You ever, ever what? Emma, where is it? <laughs> and how does it, I mean, how is it? Is it doing... I'm pretty sure that's a form of harassment. <laughs> okay, let's okay. let's oh, okay. keep going. All right. uh, Sorry, <laughs> I hope it's I hope it's doing well. Thank you. Are, are yep. you more of a man or a minion? <laughs> <laughs> I love this. What does that even mean? Uh, I'm more of a minion. Why Sorry, I got really excited when he asked that. Yeah. What do you What do you think? Depends on who I need to. Oh. You know, depends on what I'm trying to get. Right. Right. Yeah. You trying to steal like the moon or like a pyramid, yeah. like vector. Then you're yeah, a exactly. Then you, get, then you go minion. Then oh, I yeah. go minion. If you're yeah. trying to, like, it's easier to blend in with the crowd. You know, it's a that's very true. straightforward disguise. <laughs> There's a lot of them. Yeah, if you're yeah. trying to hex the moon. My mom likes minions because she says they look like little Valium pills. <laughs> <laughs> Not what I was expecting. <laughs> Sorry, what is what is Valium? Yeah, let's, Valium. Uh, uh, they call it's also known as like mommy's little helper. It's like an anxiety okay. med. Mm. Um, so my mom, I think that's why moms, this is true. <laughs> Most this people like true. that. This is my mom's they theory. Help. Funny. Yeah. On why like so many moms love minions is because they oh look like little God. yellow Valium pills. Yeah. Mommy's oh. little happy pills. So yeah. it gives them almost like a feeling of nostalgia. Yeah. 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 And they, and yeah. when you take them, they, you start talking like the minions too. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You have too many. Yeah. Bobble bobble. <laughs> that's what your kids sound like. Oh no. Oh Jesus. Yeah. Oh, everyone around you, you go out into the... <laughs> You go out into the society and everyone's been going, blah, 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 blah. Um, yeah. It's a Black Mirror episode. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, let's get a Black Mirror minions. episode just on Valium pills. I think that would be, I think I that feel would like be. most of the show was written on some kind of crazy drug. Yeah. No. Oh, have, you, have you watched it, all you guys, Black Mirror? I've seen a couple episodes. Yeah. I'm a big baby, so it like fucks. It actually, mm. I get emotionally upset. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like it's weird. To I was gonna ask, what's your favorite Black Mirror? Ooh, and I was like, I feel question. like that's a really that's bad a question. question. It, maybe it's the one. What answer? It, I mean, if I were to answer legitimately, I would yeah. say nosedive. You know that one, the one with the oh, the the social media ratings one. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I've seen. That's one of the four episodes I've seen. That, and that one's yeah. kind of like easy to yeah. like deal with. That's an influencer moment. For it sure, is that is an influence yeah. moment. Yeah. I, I just watched a uh, play test. Oh, play test is my favorite. What is that this? one? Messed me up. It's up. It was good. It's His acting up. was oh. really good, but it messed me yeah. up. Where yeah. the guy was like hitchhiking, the hitchhiker, yeah, and VR and mm -hmm. all that. Mm -hmm. Yep, right. Yep. Huh. Yeah, they're all kind of. I would bad. say that Black Mirror, as you were saying, is sort of. Oh my just... god, it's like a screen. Yeah. Well, yeah, it's like a phone that's turned off and then it becomes a Black Mirror. Um, but is that why it's named that? Yeah, yeah. it is. Oh, I was doing oh, it. Oh, I was doing it as a Oh, wait. <laughs> I said that as oh. a bit. Oh. Black. Turn it off. Turn it off. You see yourself. Yeah. It's a black mirror. Is that is that for real? <laughs> that yeah, that's for real. Legitimately, that's I'm, for real. I'm 90% sure. I think sure. if it's not for real, they would they just pick two random words. Yeah, so yeah. I think it's probably for I real. just never thought to like think about it. I take things at like face value, right. you know, a lot I'm of the time, and I choose not this. to think deeper. Yeah. There's a lot of shit. Like this, that I have this problem with, like a tow truck in my head is a tow truck, and then I like only once will ever think about it. Like, oh my god, it's towing a car. That's what the why. Fuck are you talking? Do you know about? what I'm talking about? Like no. when it's a no, word. I get you. you get me? Yeah, I get oh, it. Oh, thank fucking god. Well, you have to explain this. You... Okay, a water bottle, right? Yeah. I'm, in my head, I'm like, oh, it's a water bottle. No way. Does that like is this? Oh, anything? so you're talking about like words that make sense as the word, like <laughs> yeah, but like in like my head they're like flag, a different. Like you see a flag waving, you're like, yeah, it's a flag. Are you kidding me right now? Wait, so no, 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 no. But what makes that a makes flag sense? A that makes no. It, no, but it, a flag's just a flag. Like, what is a flag about? Well, a flag? I mean, that's what I'm saying. When you see a flag and you associate the word flag with it, you're like, yeah, that's definitely that's a flag. It makes sense that this yeah, is yeah, like called a flag. lawnmower. Pole. Lawnmower yeah. is like it's a lawnmower. There it goes. I don't realize yeah, or that like, it's called that because it's mowing. This is, yeah, or this like is a when table. People, Listen, when what? people say, like, oh, I'm going to put my food in, like, the Tupperware. Oh, right. It's like a wear for Tuppers. What? No. Yeah. What but is a Tupper? I will say. What I, is, no. What, what is a about? Tupper? <laughs> it's, a little, it's a little guy. A, little a guy, Tupper little, is a little guy? It's a little Grimbly. You know what I'm talking about? Well, okay. Grimbly? Expand. Yes. A little Define Grimbly. Grimbly. Well, he, yeah, he's a guy. Besides being a Tupper. Well, he's a guy. Yeah. You take him off and you put him back on. But sometimes you he's a Tupper. And he has So you put him in a wear. Exactly. Okay, so she gets it. This is why she's on the podcast. Uh, yeah, I feel bad. Can now we agree though that. that the dude who named the table was totally right? Like this ain't anything else. <laughs> Table's good. It's That's, not. It's solid. It can't be anything yeah. else. Yeah. This oh, is not like if it, it was called yeah. like a, and I mean like a staple. That also makes sense because you're you're you're, you're stapling it. Well, like I mean, tow truck. What if this was called like a wood leg? 
Well, it's like, I mean, it's wood not legs. really like a leg. Tab- table. 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 No, I like yeah. table. Yeah. Just like What's a wood circle. Yeah. Would make more sense. Yeah, but some can be square. That can we, so you're wrong. Can we rename, like, I'll things? <laughs> I'd like to rename Like, some what if things. we went down the... I'm just looking around the room. So, like, do you think soup is an appropriate name for soup? Yes. To begin? Yeah. No, soup is soup. Well, f- if they've already got it on fucking lock, we don't need to do this. How about j- uh, jam slash jelly? I feel like it could be called, like... Sp- I think I just... Ca- I'd, I'd like to call jam maybe <laughs> some... I feel like you could... Doesn't you don't need, need a jam. new word for j- what jam is. It's b- like you could just call it like sweet grease. Every time I hear jam, though, I just because you know jam has like multiple connotations. Like you know the joke that's like, what's the difference between peanut butter and jam? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. You can't jam your dick into somebody, or you can't peanut butter your dick into somebody's ass. <laughs> oh. So whenever I hear true. jam, I just think about that joke. You know, so jam so has can't. you know two meanings. So maybe we should rename jam that way. I don't. Associate yeah, because you don't want to get it mixed dick up. Into somebody's for dick. sure. Yeah, if you've seen One Man One Jar, then you know that both. Mm. What? Oh. Huh? Oh. oh, oh. I mean, peanut butter and jam would mm. both work in that scenario. That is s- true. Have you seen that video? Yeah. Who hasn't? Yeah, I haven't. That's fair. Oh. Hey, I, Scott, I mean, I can make up a song. Wow. No, Scott, do not. Scott, play my music instead. Producer, producer Borov, have you ever seen One Man One Jar? No. There nice it job, is. Boris. He hasn't seen it. There it is. Yeah. Very yeah. good. Would it's you like to? Yeah, why not? No. <laughs> I don't think <laughs> I don't know about that. And that's why we – so for we hadn't referenced him before on the last podcast that we oh, yeah. did, but Borf is back, ladies and gentlemen. He is back for Chuckle Week 2.0, and we are so excited well, to give it up for here. our boy Welcome Borf. Back. Um, if you're at home, if you're in a public place, I don't care, clap. <laughs> for our audio listeners, love you to death. I mean, come on. You got to just watch the video for this one. I know you guys are going to be mad at me for saying that, but I mean, it's Borof. Look at his beautiful face. Look at his beautiful eyes. His angelic voice. Borof, can his you hum into the mic? Eyes, his <laughs> Oh, my God. Oh, and oh it, my it, God. He, I feel oh. like I'm at church. He's got such a, a beautiful Someone vocalization. Ring the bell. His tone, his, his timbre, beautiful. I like so that. So we're so happy to have yeah. Borof here. It is good to uh, It's an honor to, to be in his Borof. presence. Yeah, I know, right? It's yeah. like you, you're, you're here and you're like, Man, I'm in a place of inspiration. I'm yeah. in I'm, the Borf sphere. Yeah. yeah, like I'm with these mm-hmm. nerds. When you but speak at least to I him, you almost need to tell the truth because you know that he'll know if you're lying. And you wouldn't call him anything else. He's so Borf. Borf. Yeah. He's Borf. Yeah. He's Borf. Yeah. Like he can't be anything else. Yeah. What is he if not Borf? Just some dude. Just some dude. Yeah. And he's not. He's Borf. I find it upsetting to think about that there could be a reality in which I would have passed Borf on the street and then no. never have met him. Oh. Time that, works, time I works sometimes slow down. think That's about that and it, it yeah. absolutely shatters my. It is, it's like a Black Mirror episode. Is like it's, it's like a world without the street, like a life no without horror for me. That title. Wait, you're talking about like him screen. going down into his apartment and just like sitting there in silence. You're, you're talking about a complete like an episode that follows Borof. Where it's just an episode <laughs> of him and but nobody, sad? nobody yeah. like goes on his. That is. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like you're kind of And he's like trying to be like, hey guys, it's me. But like, everybody's like, (laughs) hey guys, it's me. I'm Borf. And they're like, some car drives past and like sprays up a bunch of water on him and he's wet for the rest of the (laughs) day. God, that sounds, we would, that would be the worst Black Mirror episode. The most upsetting. It would be. I wouldn't be able to get through that. Or if you're the kind of guy that if right now, if we like shifted timelines and I passed you on the street, I would look back. You know what I mean? I'd look back and wonder what could be. I mean that. Yeah. I have another word thing that I thought of. You're, okay. Can okay. I can I bring it up? It, I mean, if it can, it can if it's be- more relatable than um, like a where you put tuppers in. Yeah. In, with the little grimblies. What were they called? Grimblies. Yes. Little. You gr- actually have a couple on you right now. Get up there, little oh, guys. Thank you. Oh. The Sometimes they they we have a little grimbly infestation. Okay. God. Um, We're all over the place. I'm not gonna catch it from being here. Am I? <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. Uh, no, humans can't get grimblies. Um. So when something is a gate. <laughs> Sorry, I just say shit, man. I'm fucking sorry. When I mean, something, he's not wrong. When yeah. something is a gape, when you're ninety percent, it's because robot. it's gaping. <laughs> no, yes. keep, keep. Oh, I'm sorry, I picked that one. No, proceed. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> when you've seen her tweets, you're just giving her. You're giving yeah, her. Yeah, I'm. Uh, no, right no, 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 no. I'm not. I'm not done. I'm not done. But when like something is like slightly open, it's ajar. Yes. Why? Because with a gape, I get it. It's gaping. But it's not like it's jarred, right? So I'm just that's crazy. You know string theory at all. It. Whenever you what open are you talking something, about Schrodinger's theory? cat. Yeah. Even Fortnite talked about this at one point in their lore, <laughs> if you get into it at all. Yeah, okay. Um when you open a door, 
all, and only in the process of opening a door, due to an observer being there, it becomes literally a jar. So everything you so, wait. Hang on. So when you're not looking at something, it's a you know jar? when I th when I was making this podcast, I thought when I chose my co-host, I thought they would be smart. But you know, as I do this podcast more, I realize you know, maybe Dude, I yeah, was a Grimbley's going for your jugular. A Grimbley is going for your jugular. He's he's climbing. <laughs> you gotta get him out of there. You got oh nice that was, that was a small one. Yeah, that was they slip in a little micro Jim Grimbley. <sighs> you ever had a fucking fat Grimbus before? You know what I'm talking about. Yes, I Just mean, a sometimes. Massive Can I ask a question about the set? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm really distracted by the photo behind Schlatt of, like, a family on the beach in yeah, black if, and if white. Yeah, we could focus on that first. Yeah, here we like, go. I, it's just Can you perfect. believe like, I used to look like that? I keep like focusing that? on it. So how I like to describe this earlier was that this looks like um, a screenshot of in a movie when the, like, main yeah. character, uh, like, male lead has to go and kill a bunch of people and he's remembering his wife that died oh, and it's ugly. that black and white uh this is yeah. when he gets knocked down yeah before like, he gets back up back yeah and, and then like, he's like trying to get back up and he yeah sees she's the like frame. she's like vanessa and he's like she's calling yeah. out to her and she's like come see me sometime or they're like she's like come around. see me sometime, see me sometime. Yeah. Yeah. what an emotional vanessa. line like she's dead and it's like maybe like some sort of over maybe we can hang out later or whatever you know i'm 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 right I like, oh, it's like, it, like you know, in an office, so you keep like a nice little, You're like, I just. Turning it away from the camera. Well, I like having it. Context. It's not for them. It's for this me, is, you know? Okay. Um, I just, yeah. I just remember them so fondly. Yeah. This was the family I rammed the back of my Tesla Model Y rental into and killed. Respect. On the 405 last night. Well, he loves his cars. He loves his cars. On my cars. Yeah. So, I Emma, just, you're from New Jersey. Unfortunately. Yeah. How does Sorry that, about that. How does that. Um, yeah, how's New Jersey these days? What's the you don't live there. how about this? What's <laughs> the best part of New Jersey? Um, that's close to New York. What's the worst part of New Jersey? Um, New I came <laughs> from it. it. That's the worst that's part the worst of New part? Jersey. I sincerely all right, all right. doubt that. Bruce Springsteen. Bruce Damn. Springsteen is the whoa. You wow. know, he did get a DUI recently. So I'm sure my, that he's got multiple. <laughs> Bruce Springsteen got a DUI recently driving through a national park while under the influence. I know. And in this picture, he was such a sweet kid, too. So. Yeah, I know. Oh. Tommy in it Bruce loves he, Bruce. He I does. had to break it to him, and he was like, no, that didn't happen. No, no, no. He didn't do that. <laughs> yeah, can you do your best Tommy in it impression right now on the podcast? <laughs> What is like those what is little he doing? fucking sounds he makes in between every word he it says? It just sounds like you're he's just going through like like he's been stabbed. Like he's yes, exactly. Yeah. Every Lord That's stream. what you think Tommy sounds like. Every Lord stream like when Dream escapes from the prison. <laughs> he has done that a lot recently. He should get checked for asthma. Yeah. He should. Yeah. Yeah. He I'm should. worried about the kid. Yeah, I'm yeah. worried about all of them. All of them over there. Why are they in the UK? What have they got over there? Do yeah, they know there's like knives cold? and shit there? Yeah. They, they yeah. Always, and acid attacks. Acid attacks acid on the attacks. tube. Yeah. Oh, you know the new Nerf guns, the rival shit? They fucking hurt. They're intense. They fucking hurt. Is that hurt. the one you have in your story. story. Yes. I have a fucking story. Yes. And I'm telling you, if you get a home invader, you don't even need a gun at this point. You just whip that baby off. That dude is going to, he is going to be sore. Yeah. And he's going to need to, like, hide for a second and catch his breath. <laughs> Recuperate. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, wait you. for the red to yes. go out from his vision. <laughs> yeah, he's going to have to hold um, up his stamina again yeah, before he can go back uh, when, in. When I was a kid, my brother and I um, had this... Maybe you guys will remember it. It was like a big rocket launcher with all these gun attachments. And you got it all in one thing. It was like one that had like 12 different shots. There was like a pistol. And you could turn it all into one gun. But the main rocket, you would actually like pump. Like it was a big fucking thing. You'd put oh, it between your legs, shit. pump it I, like an air I pump. I definitely know what you're talking about. You know about. what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, and when sure. we got this thing, we were like so fucking small. We were like six and seven or something like that. And we would take turns. Like this thing could feasibly kill us like the rocket it was so <laughs> powerful we weren't allowed to shoot it in the house so what we do is we go outside and we take turns we'd each curl up into a ball on the ground and we shoot each you other with it the fetal position because it would knock us back so if we like did it standing <laughs> up like fuck? we'd get hurt so we'd like be like oh it's my turn to shoot no, you <laughs> time to so you said your brother assume the position yeah and then yeah. you yeah you and then you hit and he just goes rocket. like skidding you know what i mean and it was it was great 
You ever do it like down a hill or something just to get get momentum? <sighs> we tried or to like look for smooth, smooth surfaces for like maximum distance. We did have a sledding hill though, also right next to our house that was really steep and just had a brick wall, and we mm -hmm. saw who could do it the fastest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you've never slid into a wall or a fence. I like, seriously you've never you saw, really you, experienced sledding. So you saw who could hit it the fastest. <laughs> Yeah, I've that was the competition. I mentioned this the game was called "Who Can Be the a be Crash Test Dummy Competition." <laughs> <laughs> Who can have the least bones by the end, or the most, depending on definition. Yeah. Um, no, I, I. You're gonna be one of those old people that says that like has has a lot of back in my day statements. Like back Dude. in my day, we were seeing how fast we could run into a brick wall <laughs> as children did for just fun, for, for fun, for fun, and it was cool, and kids liked it. I would still do it. Don't you cannot forget about them after I what they did for us to, i want to i know I still but you have the to accept them as part of your life this will follow you forever i probably got up to like 30 miles an hour and that was fast for me yeah, i was small you were a child there's I was no a, way you were going like five miles per hour and you i i mean i didn't have mass but i had speed i still have a thing emma i don't know how many of these you've listened to but i still have a thing about like i really want to be flung at high speeds without consequence i feel like you've said this so many times and every time you I say it that. it's just the way you describe it makes it just sounds sound pretty awesome right well, well there's lots of like thrill rides that consist of that sort of thing uh, like what like you remember like you ever go to, like jersey shore I mean, no 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 i haven't but no. they have like those D balls that they put you in you know and they remember they like shoot oh, the you big, up into like the fucking air wait what yeah, you had me. No, you had me. Talking at about the like Action Park, <laughs> the place where people <laughs> die. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. I mean, if you want a thrill ride, Action Park. Maybe. I will. I will say, but if Action Park was open now, I would go. Oh, I go. That's it's still it. Now. They revamped it. They reopened it. it with a, under a new name. Well, I mean, surely. I think well, it's not no, the same. It's it's back to Action Park sure. now. Oh, they're calling it Action Park. Yeah, they re it was Mountain Creek, and now I think it's Action Park again. That worries me though, because like then they're playing into it. You know what I mean? Yeah, because the documentary came out, and they're like, "Woo, we're still here." Yeah, that's us those people died yeah like what remember all the children that died here yeah oh well come anyway. see their graves oh my god yeah, five dollar they put admission. little tombstones next to the fucking <laughs> wave pool you know just with their like, names you, you can get a flash oh my god like the markers on the side of a highway where someone died in a car crash yeah and they just have them next to the, the wave pool on the wave pool yeah. oh was it the now alpine a quick slide ceremony at what, low else? Time. what would be other names of the rides oh my goodness but anyway to be flung at high speeds in yes. the jersey shore and yeah. i'm sure other like boardwalks not and, like, ideal carnival place things, but i'll do it there's like those rides that you know it's like they strap you into that bowl thing and they launch you into the sky and you're just attached to a string and then you come plummeting back into the ground do you know what i'm talking about and it spins Sorry, as it's you're throwing you're switching you? and it's really funny you're what? like gradually you're gradually shifting i was not sure if you're saying ball or bowl but is it like is it like a big plastic, like softball? No, like, it's, it's like a, it's like a cage it's like almost. It's like a two-seater, right? Yeah, it's like a two-seater, like cage. Strings you sit on in. either side. It's like a bungee thing. Then it. Yeah. It like oh, launches oh, you oh, into oh, the oh, air. Well, I think, oh. Aren't you saying though that you just want your own body without any sort of contraption like connected oh, to you? Oh, just like, you, you yourself. Like he just wants to be like. So what I would suggest to you is like yeah. maybe get some like draft up some plans. If you look into. I've done some um, of that. Have you heard stuff. of Have you heard of uh, medieval trebuchets? I ha Schlatt likes talking Those about them things. and their applicable they used to, strategies. They used to sling bodies across yeah, the Great sling Wall corpses of China. over. Yeah, the yeah, plague. The, the plague. The plague. Oh. Yeah. But imagine yeah. the view <laughs> as you're, as you're and sailing. They, and then they'd be going so fast and went so high that when they hit the ground, they exploded, and then all the shit went everywhere. Yeah, the poop? We, he talks about this a the, lot. No, the. The, the the guy the guy the goo guy goo the guy goo the the virus all that the giblets of the giblets the little things that still on the no, those are, those are, no those are grimblies those oh, go the grimblies specifically are in grimblies. Tupper. The, those are tuppers that specifically yeah. go in wares mm -hmm. Emma have you ever Hence seen little tupper. creatures you can't explain <laughs> like to any no one ever I'd like to you? know that too and I that's I and I remember you talking about this with me that's part of the reason why we wanted to have you on the podcast because yeah. you seem to have a lot of experiences with little <laughs> little creatures you can't <laughs> explain <laughs> like little besides myself um besides yeah <laughs> yeah i mean b and being a little creature that you can't explain yourself i mean it you would know the category very well i'm i'm sure are we talking about my psychological related oh. ones or the nor the normal kind it's not... hard to tell the difference sometimes it is i get that for sure 
I've gotten familiar though, because the shadow people I see when I'm hallucinating, uh-huh. and then there's the shadow people that are actually there They're and like to come shadow cuddle. People. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The cuddly ones. Yeah, I, more of is like that. Yeah, originally yeah. the cuddly ones showed up first, and yeah. then the then the creepy ones started showing up, and they did not want to cuddle. Yeah. I tried; oh, they no. did they not like they, it. They wanted mm-hmm. to boogie with the dance of death. Mm-hmm. I get little yeah. friends sometimes in my eyeballs. Oh, the little flo- I used Aww. to think I was nuts. Floaters. I would, yeah. I would like after yeah. uh, after swim practice for some reason. I'd be like sitting on this curb, and I remember it vividly because I always had to, like wait an hour, mm-hmm. and I had nothing to do, and I was just staring at a parking lot. What I haven't even. I don't know. I'm just. It, and I'm, occasionally I'm, I'd be like, "What was that?" And I'd try and follow it, but it yeah, would get really away too you fast. Can't, you just, can't just follow just those things. Charlie trying to fall around a floater in his eye <laughs> in a parking lot. It's just like this child walking around a parking lot, and like someone's away, and like eating, like some worker eating lunch. He's like, "You think my kid's okay, Joe?" And he's like, <laughs> "He's just over there, like, there oh yeah, that's." I'm the over there. I'm over there, like shifting to Terabithia, <laughs> like straight up. I like yeah. saw these fucking things, and every time I try to look at them, they fly away. Yeah, that's so the I'm neighborhood like, wandering child me. again. Like they know I'm trying to look at them, mm. so then I try to like look straight ahead, so they'd like come to me. Yeah. You I tried this, to is herd, this you, had, you tried to herd eye floaters. <laughs> I didn't know they were called eye floaters. Yeah, I thought they floaters, were like little I think that that's just sprites. it's not necessarily what they're called. I think it's just everyone's greed that little, that is little what they are. Little squigglies. Yeah. It's hard yeah. to like find them when you're Oh. No. You stare into the sun I, for I got long a couple. Enough. I mean, we got this that's giant fucking light, light on us. Fucking so. light. Oh my Listen, god. I I get them when I'm driving. Most of the time, and really? then it's like a friend on a little road trip. It's a medical condition. That's fine. Well, well yes. here's the thing. I mean, they're, <laughs> what? Um, yeah, if you see floaters while you're driving, what does it? What does it mean? Uh, or is it just? Is that the whole it, condition? It's just something that alters your vision. I think. Yeah. Oh, should, so I shouldn't be driving. You should go see an eye doctor. One of one of my friends, he was getting. <laughs> that explains a lot. Huh? One of my friends was getting more eye Wait, floaters did... than normal, and he went to the doctor, and he found out that his oh, um that. that there was a potential that his like eye muscles were getting disconnected from like his brain like his retina oh. or something like oh that oh my god if it's a if you're getting a lot of them you that might be yeah, something to I'll, check out i was gonna say that totally explains the accident from yesterday with the with the family of three family of that three. would make a lot of sense your Tesla little but your little buddy and what's too. remarkable about this photo is that not only was this like is the means in which you got this because you Ran into this family of three, and then yeah. you started, you know, I dug looting their <laughs> dead bodies, and then that's how you found a key to their house. Pub G Go style. into their house, and you're like, oh, I guess this is, this will make it yeah. worth it. And then I said, winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> and then I like took they it. Did, like, like it was a game of PUBG. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. PUBG style. Yeah. I respect it. <laughs> that's my new thing. I'm gonna start saying PUBG, PUBG style, style after you kill people because yeah, the, yeah, because like the after after floaters you... in your eye told you to. <laughs> after, after you after you finish in sex, you know after PUBG, PUBG style. style. Yeah, well, listen, no, the floaters aren't mean or anything. They don't tell me to do anything. I don't They're think just, anyone was asking if the lo- floaters were mean or anything. I did. I did. They're I along did for the ride, They're... and I'm the driver. Have sure. you ever considered that you're along for the ride? Um. Whoa. Do they ever make like little arrows like telling you where to go? No. No. Like you're telling me your eye floaters are shaping into arrows and giving you directions <laughs> places? Hang on. What's that, little guys? <laughs> no way. You're telling me to U turn. <laughs> <laughs> right here? <clears throat> yeah. It, honestly, if my eye floaters told me something, I would like do it, no questions asked. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's a new Neuralink chip. It is. It yeah. just says buy Tesla. Or some shit like in front if, of your eyes. If it just it. like for, if I like was like looking around, all of a sudden I saw like run vaguely, run. like you might have just like start spreading. <laughs> I would hundred percent follow any instructions like implanted by floaters. Is there a situation in which you guys could see yourself in the future getting one of those like brain chips? Like if, if give Wait, it like twenty years. No, I just watched playtest. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. true. We yeah. just, just talked like about that. Twenty years where it's like becoming sort of like, oh, everyone's got like a Valve Index kind of, or like a good amount of people have Valve Index, but it's like expensive. That kind of like yeah. level of like everyone's uh, got the extra RAM now, you know? Yeah, everyone's got the bionic left arm. Yeah, bionic. Uh, bio-cock. I would love a bionic arm. Really? Or a cock? That too. But like, well, we said arms first. So I we'll mean, stick that's. With that. I mean, you know, a biocock would count as both. I'm going to buy an EMP now and just fucking save it up, man. Third arm. You could get, th- this is true, you could EMP a population and have them all shut down. You could EMP a fucking, bra- that's what I was going to oh. say. I'll buy one now before they're made illegal. Yeah. Put it in my basement. 
and then you activate and then it, and then you wait, walk around. What in your basement? The EMP. EMP. Yeah. And then just wait until I. It looks like every day that everyone's like a little more like. <laughs> yeah. Can oh, you cyber? more borged out? Back more borged up. out. You Back wait up. until they're borged out. You activate now? the EMP, and then you loot PUBG <laughs> I don't style. Think, I don't think that you can buy an EMP, EMP currently. What are you I don't talking think about? A, it's not so. It's, Oh, you you're walking into a Walmart and you're like, oh, I just I buy an EMP, I mean, I style, the EMP. You can make it's napalm with cardboard. What? What? You can? You yes. Can, an, EMP, an EMP, you could just make it with a brick. Yeah. You it's know, easy. The, I will say one thing. And a couple Molotov wires. Molotov cocktails, very accessible. Oh, yeah. You go down oh, yeah. to a BevMo. That's going to do nothing against the Borgs, dude. <laughs> that's going to do nothing against the them. The Borgs? That the just Bo sounds like the like... army that Borif has ri risen to fight back. <laughs> Borif and the Borgs, bro. Holy shit. I'm just saying, when you throw them all top and they tear their fucking skin off, like, don't be surprised. Okay. When they're all... And that's Terminator when... 2. Terminator 2. Living... Metal. No, no living no, flesh. Living, living flesh Me over metal, metal endoskeleton. endoskeleton. Yes. Mm -hmm. You what like you... Terminator? I've never seen it. That, oh fuck? my god, the biocock. We've come full fucking mm. circle. Yeah. yeah, that's why. Yeah. It totally does. There's oh, a big awesome. shot in Terminator 1 at the beginning of the movie when he spawns in. He's a big cock. He spawns in. All over. The context behind yeah. that was the last time we did a Truckle Week, we we had a, an Airbnb that was filled with Etsy furniture, and mm -hmm. it had a little... Oh! Don't. Just keep going for now. Oh! Sorry. Oh, sometimes okay. just, I'm familiar. Okay. I know, he, but sometimes he just... Fuck. He has his angry comes Sorry. in the middle of podcast hey, recording. Why would you <laughs> say it like? Why did you put so much emphasis on that particular word? His angry comes. His angry yeah. Comes? Just, why did you like you? Sometimes just, I'm not gonna lie on the podcast. Look, Schlatt just, sometimes gets guy. his little angry cummies every now and then. <laughs> um, it happens. Schlatt, do you feel a little anger coming on you? Can I pour you a glass of water? Is that a threat? No. Thanks. Oh, I seriously? hate when I go into an into a fucking Airbnb that I rent with my own money, and it's like the room is big. There's a lot of that's space. Such a small but amount of water. But that there's you just fucking. You didn't even small, give it back to her either. But there's just... small little <laughs> shitty Etsy furniture throughout the whole thing. Like you is have a, you have a water? huge wall, Ted. He, stop it! Stop <laughs> it! I'm not done with it. Huge wall, <laughs> tiny little <laughs> canvas, one by one inch canvas print, and it's you're like, this is. I can search up. Canvas print on Etsy, and I found it. It's like the negative space is the rest of the piece. Listen, yeah. we rented this beautiful, <laughs> beautiful you are house such a piece in the Hollywood, yeah, honestly, man. Hollywood you're, you're, Hills. You in are the Hollywood a, Hills. You are a, a rented gross, this beautiful gross house. person. And we walk in, and look what it is. It's this shitty ass furniture. The house itself is furnished it's nicely. Really but not that a bad. A whole layer of bullshit, like shitty little table lamps that don't even go up Actually, all it's the got way. Like a full on nice. pool table the couch, the like the couch is the shittiest. Aesthetic. It's like a hundred dollar sectional that's falling apart. It doesn't even fasten it's, to itself. I think it's just the TV couches. doesn't work. It's not. The TV doesn't work. Neither remote works. The 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 master bedroom. There's Which not even a took. bed frame. There's not even a bed frame. Oh, he's a mattress. Yeah, he's complaining Basically about a mattress the master on the floor. bedroom. Both of the nightstands are literally a foot tall, and they the two drawers slide all the way out, and they just fall onto the ground. See, this is particularly master funny bedroom. Right. So it's an Airbnb in the hills full of IKEA furniture. Yes. Basically, yeah. Worse, but I it's will say this: it's like Wayfair shit. You guys ever get high and go to IKEA and make up stories about all the little displays? Whoa! Th what? No, but that no. actually sounds. That is such fun. a specific thing that I want to hear. That about. is just one of my favorite activities. Okay, no, give us like, uh, do. give me something. Give yeah. me an example. Or? I don't because I need like a visual. You know what? Okay, I, I don't fine. have okay. examples. Okay. But it is. Uh, picture the like picture the gluten fargan in front of you. Yes, yeah, gluten fargan, <laughs> Lerberg over yeah. there. Yeah. But you know how they have all the room setups, right? Uh, so I'll like go in the kitchen. And if it's like a cold, like steel, like black, like kitchen, you know, I'm gonna be like, oh, like definitely like a serial killer lives here, and this is where he chops off the bodies, and this is the freezer that he stores them in, like stuff like that. Oh. Is it always yeah. that intense? Well, it could be, and then sometimes there's like you know, oh, so light, you, you there's tell light a story little. For each I, room? I tell a story for each room and That's each cool. display wow. they have, but That's you got to cool. do it on edibles. You could probably do that forever too, because it never ends. How do you get yeah. there to the IKEA? Um, well, I don't drive, so I just Ubers. get an Uber. Yeah. You Uber to the Ikea on edibles? Ikea? Yeah. Or, that's, that's like a Or I have out. a sober, you know, person drive. Right. Yeah. yeah. You kind of just find the entrance. You know what I mean? Yeah. Honestly, I have, have gotten I have the... gotten lost and circled around there multiple times before. Mm -hmm. There are some times well, where it gets a little scary. I think you're going to oh. say. And I think, have you heard of that SCP? No. Do you know of SCPs at all? No. The, it's the... Secure, it, contain, secure, contain, protect. Protect. It's a... Uh, 
like a wiki basically that has been it's a collaborative wiki that's existed for a long time where people I'm, i got your water all finished <laughs> um, what did you put in well, it <laughs> you got it all all good for yeah you. well we'll just leave it in the center there until um and it's it's basically like just a bunch of uh, Charlie, you just have to explain what it is. <laughs> you just give it up. I'm, well, no, I'm, uh, yeah. It's like a, it's like a community sourced wiki of essentially writing prompts that people make of like weird like creatures or locations. Kind of like creepy pasta. Oh, it's sort of like creepy pasta, but it's all like you know the same kind of universe. So you know, it, it could be like creepy guy that if you see him, he'll kill you, or it could be like. There's one that is just like an infinite Ikea, yeah, right? It's, an it's infinite like infinite oh, Ikea that has I've a... I've definitely had that experience. Yeah, but well, here's it's based the thing. On, yeah. It's an infinite, it's an Ikea that exists in real life, but if you go into it, all of a sudden you become lost in this Ikea and it's infinitely long, but then also there are quote unquote workers, which are just, you know, uh, seven foot tall people in, people in Ikea uniforms that don't have a face that if they find you, they will come up to you and say, the store is closed now, please make your way to the exit. Um, and they'll kill you. <laughs> just, you. You just ruined any future IQ trip Emma does. No, I think it makes it more exciting. I mean, if I so actually checked you that while you were high, you maybe it would probably I'd be. upset her more. I think it'd be fun. It's, She's gonna like see a, a lamp like or a something. Because then it's like a challenge, you know like, what yeah, I mean? Because yeah. yeah. it's like, you know, I just, okay, I have this, like, complex thing okay. where, like, I think I'm a very murderable person. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I, but, like, and I great really thing to don't want to say, too, on a podcast. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. on a podcast. <laughs> I've, so I've discussed it, but, like, I just really don't want to give anybody the satisfaction of killing me. Yeah. You know? Interesting. Because sometimes I'm like, I am so insufferable that I don't want anybody to mm. have the pleasure of being the one to take me out. Right. right. So you're saying, like, you would, you're, You'd I think be a I, good murder. So if you got I, stabbed, you don't you'd like want to run into the street. No, I, I think no. Like I think like if you told me this while I was high, I would just incentivize it to like survive. You know what I mean? Okay. Like if these IKEA workers trying to kill me, like I feel <laughs> yeah. like it would like awaken something like, in I me. I won't let you have. Yeah, that. like I won't let you get like the, the satisfaction of killing me. At the end me. of Halo Reach. It's not yes, even like exactly. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Perfect um, way to describe so it. So it's not even self preservation. It's just no. I don't value myself. Yeah. Just I do everything out of spite. Wow. I had this uh, water for you. What's in it? Nothing. What's in it? Oh, it's water. no, it is by definition still water. It's just water. Is it thick water? It's definitely different than it was. <laughs> <laughs> it's not thin anymore. I have an issue with like cummy textures. Am oh I allowed to am I allowed to No, I'm actually proud of am you. Am I for allowed just... to spit on the set? Yeah. Yeah, do we have a Spit bucket. I was just, I was, like, I was just like, I'll like spit well, on the actually, fucking table. I mean, before. no one else is gonna have the thick water if you want to just Excuse spit. Me. Okay, that. this can be your. My spit. <laughs> <laughs> your people would pay good money for this, I, just so you know. I'm, I'm sure they would. E girl spit. <laughs> um. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm out of. Does this mean I have to drink it? We don't it? have a sponsor on this episode. No. Oh, you and, were, I mean, and and with we, the content, and we you won't. You wouldn't. I hope you weren't planning on it. Yeah. Um, um, I mean, so surely, I guess I mean, just, whenever you're you know, at your own pace. Um, it's warm. Yeah. Sorry. It smells like powdery. It smells like a communion wafer. Really? Oh Wait, my god! Smell? Yeah, it smells. It smells like communion wafer. Like, Catholic. Is it actually? Man. You are taking it deep. Can I, can I? Okay. Well, don't get. I don't want to drink it all your. I can make you a new batch. I can't, I can't, <laughs> can't smell anything from it. I, uh, so, so what's like the we can't really it's like thick. It's thick. thick. I don't know. Do There's like, like not much more to say right, about so it, to I'll, be honest. I'll, I'll be completely upfront with you. All I put in it was Walgreens Thick Now. Instant food and beverage thickener. It's just gonna. It's, it's gonna literally just, just thick. Thicker. It's thick. Yeah. And that's like it. Like milk. Like a nectar. Um. No. <laughs> no. Nectar. No. It's not milk. Just take it, yeah. Just take a sip and feel feel the like the teeth feel. Get the mouth first. There are sixty sort of milk calories in this drink now. Thicker than like oh. a normal liquid. Yeah. Milk isn't that. Milk is not too thick. Milk is. If I milk feel like well, it's compared to water. water. How long have you had this milk that is now thicker? Ooh, it does get thicker. Perhaps it is. So okay, so like Ooh. water, milk, Maybe blood, come. Like thickness Wait, level. What, what was that? A fucking code? What was? What did you just water, milk, blood, come? In terms of thickness levels. How do you know how to get the into four, my safe? The four. Because I mean, the four waters, I drank. The four I drank, I've definitely taken a sip of all four. I just need to know which one we're going. Hang on, like, sorry. Okay. Give me the order again. It'll be. Th no, it'll be water, milk, 
blood this is at the end water of the list. milk blood cum so that's yeah. thinnest to thickest well i mean yeah. blood well, I is a depends. bit of a one that it changes a little bit so does, cum, actually. So does cum so does water now so does i guess milk does All too right. over let's time just, let's just get this over yeah with. i don't know man how's that where would that oh, go oh it's on? cummy she went again for a second sip of yeah. the cummy yeah. it's very powdery <laughs> Is it? Cum doesn't have you're that. Not, you're not doing a very good job of stirring these. I'm sorry. Would you like to stir it next time? No, I think you'd probably throw a fit. So what is? what are your uh, thoughts? It's like a cold load. Oh, my God. <laughs> a cold <laughs> load. <laughs> it, you said that was, was, it was such a breezy it was delivery. Such an easy she thing drank thing a lot of it, too. She delivery. drank a lot of it. There was like a third more. Guys, I'm unnerved. <laughs> <laughs> Did I, t- I didn't get to tell you guys. Um, when I got into my Uber driver, uh, to my Uber today, um, yeah, the driver immediately that? switched the music um, to gospel music as soon as I got in the car. Holy shit. And I don't know Dude, what that says about. To convert you. I don't know what that says about me as a person, but it went from like pop radio, and then we like made eye contact in the mirror, and then he looked down and changed it to Christian gospel. What he probably you, saw, he do probably you think saw it was the chains like, or something and was like. Gene. I don't. Yeah. I, I, I mean, I'm a woman like, of God. I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think it was like a she'll like this or like a kind she of needs I, this. I, like I, this is like a war? I don't think it was trying to fix me. I think he was trying to protect himself. Oh, interesting. Ooh. I think it was more like, oh, the he devil has like entered a my kind of thing. The devil has entered my car. I hope Satan gives me five stars. He's trying to yeah. create a yeah. force field of music around him. Yeah, <laughs> like he, like, because they would like say like you know like weird like God messages in between. They'd be like, oh, remember like God loves you and stuff. Was like it like that, Christian? But, like, I fucking love Christian rock. Oh, no, oh, it was like actual Christian like mo- it was actual like gospel music. Oh, okay. You yeah, it's just so boring. I don't well I don't like listen to any of it intentionally. Okay. It's more like Christian rock is the most fun thing to accidentally switch to cuz you'll start to get into it and as soon as you're comfortable they will fucking hit you with like with Jesus it. is here <laughs> and he's in you and I'm like whoa he's okay. He's inside of you. Yeah. I'm and serious. He's not it'll get you go. with a good it'll get you with a good hook. It'll be like, you know, just talking about normal music stuff. It'll just be talking about like her or whatever and then it's like That's but you know skillet. who's more than important than her? Jesus. <laughs> and it's like whoa, okay. Uh, well, <laughs> Here's a good question then. Like, what's our ideal Christian rock song? What would that look like? Oh, you know, wow. I um, believe both of you listen, went to I think Catholic a, school. Is that correct? I think I mo- did. Let me you be honest it. with you. Most of the uh, most of the Christian rock is just Protestant bullshit. Sure. Because listen, you, you go to a Protestant church and they put on a show. They put on a show. They have guitars. They have. With no yeah. organ in sight. You that walk into a true. Catholic church, there's nothing there but the organ. That and it's the lady playing the organ and singing. And it's dude, a one man show. And, and I'm all telling the old you right now, stand up that's all it needs to be, and that's all it should be. And all the old people oh. stand up, and it's just a loud, unanimous moan 90% <laughs> of the time in a Catholic what church. What church did you go to? No, if you no, go to a Catholic right. church and you hear them try to sing, it's like. Come to the I've ne- it's never just been like. Oh, <laughs> no, it's, it's, I mean? it's like, <laughs> it, it does oh, sound like- oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> here, here, uh, hun, it's, it's this page you want to, it yeah. starts right there. Oh, I just, I haven't seen that. That's all. Yeah. Everyone, everyone I've seen at churches, they've tried. Yeah, no, mean, it's Protestant bullshit. And anyone who consumes it or creates it is going straight to hell. I think. <laughs> really? Yeah. Which, which. Christian hell is real. The Catholic one. Yeah? Yeah. What's that like? What's your ideal? It's like a bunch of Calvinists in a room. Saying saying like, <laughs> saying we like, oh, knew they, it. it. No, they didn't say we knew it. They said it was always like this. <laughs> <laughs> well, is it, what, what is Calvinism? Is it, that's, Calvinism. Is predestination? Yeah. Oh, damn. Like we knew where we'd be. Yep. Yeah. I knew I was going to drink this cummy water. Are you making it into heaven, Schlatt? Me? Yeah. 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 And if all the people you've Yeah, killed? you need to make an argument You know, that's why. one of the Ten Commandments, right? I said I'm that's sorry. Uh, that's oh, right. D- did, you, did you go to church after? Yeah. You went to church today? Yeah. It's Sunday. I did. It's Lord's Day. I went to church. Dude, I'd bring my fucking Game Boy to church sometimes. Are you serious? Mm-hmm. Turn the volume down. That's the express train. That's the express A all the way uptown to hell. One time I ran Maybe my iPod sounds- Nano up oh. through my hoodie, like, you know, like through up smart. in my sleeve mm. and stuff like that. But then when we were getting up to leave, it fell out of my hoodie and my <gasps> teacher took it from me. No. Oh, I got wow. in a lot of trouble. Did you know, you remember those Pilot G2 pens that you can twist open? 
and then you put the spring in between the little clicker and the thing that holds the. You make a gun. Is that what you're talking yeah. about? Yeah. <laughs> so I went to CCD. Obviously, the the Christian, the Catholic. Oh, so you school. didn't go to Catholic school. You went to CCD. Well, I went to Catholic. I would. I would have see. I went to actual Catholic. Like no, I did. I did, I did too. Here. I did too. I would elaborate on it, but I don't want to okay. dox myself. Okay. Right. All right. Understandable. But have a great day. I, in CCD, I'd I'd turned the thing into like that little gun thing, where you can like press it and then yeah. the, the cartridge <laughs> flies forward. I just and, like how you're also giving me like un you're giving me uninterrupted eye contact as you're telling me like not looking then, at anyone Ted, else. You can you even you can even gun. take the the spring out. You go like this. It spring pops out. Stretch it a little bit, and now the gun is even more powerful. Mm. So when you, when you explode it, then you even then you then you're killing it. What'd you do? With and this? this is what God wanted you to do during CCD. When yes, you were well, supposed to be was this Jesus or the floaters that told you to do this? The, the the CCD teacher instructor came up and and he's like, "What is that?" And I said, "A weapon," <laughs> which not you don't say. <laughs> you, you just were straight to the point. You weren't even like. Oh, this is like you didn't even like give it a name or yeah. anything. You were just like, uh, "Hello, teacher. What I've made here right now in school is a weapon." <laughs> I yeah, with I, the intention I, to da make perform damage upon other humans. Legitimately, just said it's a weapon, and then he took it from me. And that was it. <laughs> that was <laughs> it. And you were like, <laughs> "Why did he do that?" You could even mod these things, Ted. You could oh, put, oh, you can mod them. Yeah, you could crumple were up. You paper? in the modding community? No, well, here's what you can do. Guns? <laughs> what you need is a Pilot G2, a wad of paper, and a paper clip. And so basically you fold out the paper clip so it's just one long, thin, sharp thing. Oh, my God. Take a wad of paper, stick it in where that pen cartridge would go, in between the clicker, the spring, the holder. This is wad basically of paper, like posting a blueprint Wad of paper. I have one, too, after this, actually. Paper clip. And it's just like a bullet. It's basically a bullet you can shoot someone. I have one that's, that's less lethal but more fun. Really? Uh, yeah, I, I don't know how I figured this out, but as a kid, I learned how to, like, with, like, a piece of paper, make it in such a way so it was, like, a little grenade container, and then Wait, I filled oh. them up. I filled them up with water. And then so it was, like, a like no matter what paper, I could do this, and it would hold it, and I would just throw it at things, and it would explode. Oh, that's fine. I could still do that. Like, if I had a sheet of paper, I could make one. Yeah, you could also just, like, save yourself time and just go outside and make a snowball in the frigid Vermont weather. That's true. <laughs> true. But you have to be ready for all seasons. Yeah. That's the thing. Um, you guys ever what like I would do, snowball? what I would yeah, do is like when you hard. finish a a water bottle, you just like mm, that's spin a classic. It. Oh yeah, you it's spin a it and then like that little bit of like water left or whatever will kind of like come out of the vapor, but it shoots the cap. Like you get the cap Absolutely. right at the end. And it... Absolutely. So what was your weapon of choice when yeah. you were a child, Emma? Um, I used to modify Beyblades and put razors into them. Holy shit. That's actually oh, much that's more. Actually... So she just beat us out of anything. Yeah, that we that's just represented. way more right. intense. That is. Really? No. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Now I'm disappointed. That'd be sick. I think my pilot G2 thing is. Uh, you is weren't lying. lying though. I was not you lying. Were, you, you were dead totally, ass. He was. Yeah. yeah. I would honestly. I was pretty excited that You're that was the case. If that was the case, I, because I had I, the joke had ready, didn't do. have any follow up. If you started Her? asking questions, oh, so man. I was like, I'll just break. The, I mean, I'll you, break early. You, you got me though. I mean, yeah. I just. I also you. bought that instantly. Yeah. Like even though I was thinking of like. I do know people who did, but we were much older. Okay, so to be this, fair, I just did so, not do it as a child. Actually, so you clear. were aware of. I was it aware happening. of this part happening. I never did it myself, and I was an adult when I found out about it. Mm. Yeah. So is it? I'm just confused by it a little bit because, like, how much does it actually impact the 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 bay blading? You know what I mean? Like, are they just like hurting each other, or are you trying to hurt each other with bay blades? You, yeah, so you yeah. you you here's what you do. I'm assuming um, you throw not a hamster. To, not yeah. to interrupt. But I understand. You, you go like this. You you let it rip. You and let then it you, rip. Then you go. Pick that up to whoever's nearby. You don't even shoot it at them. You shoot it in a different direction and say, oh. "Go get that." <laughs> you I'm just. I feel like it's hard. It's to more aim of like things. you know, you go for the ankles. My you know what I mean? When oh, so you yeah, you would yeah, shoot yeah. it at people? Yeah, like for the you go for the ankles. Okay, gotcha. It wouldn't be like you all like sit in the splash zone and like. If you could get a hold of like a rat or a hamster and trap it, that could be like. Oh, a, why would you hurt an animal? <laughs> like you would like hurt an animal. What? You heard an animal. No, I'm talking about these hypothetical, more messed up oh, children than you I ever, am. Um... You'd think about it. Yeah, like little. This is something the Grimblies would do, actually. <laughs> right. This is a Grimbly thing specifically. The Grimblies use ba razor bay blades to kill rats. And right. Have you um? Have you... you guys ever read like hamster death stories? Because they are always oh, they the always, funniest they fucking always things. Always fucking right because they just jump off of beds <laughs> because. 
No. Or they... kids mistreat them in horrible ways. And obviously it's sad that an animal died, but also it's really fucking funny sometimes my, the way they go out. My buddy um, had a bucket like turned down oh. mm -hmm. and the hamster was somehow under the lid oh, of the oh, bucket somehow he somehow got under there well i'm just saying i'm I, don't shoot the messenger ted and he sits down on the bucket not knowing and then it literally cuts the dude in half see what i mean and the eyes are like bulging out that's what i heard so i have guinea pigs this sounds like a, oh, that just sounds like a homemade yeah. hamster no. guillotine well is what be. you just described and your buddy <laughs> he's a little i can you name him? No. Interesting. See, I have, guinea pigs. I have two little guinea pigs, Fern and Mochi. They're 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 great. You look like you're gonna throw up, dude. What's going it sounds on? Sounds like you're farting in your mouth. <laughs> you have two guinea pigs. I have two guinea pigs. Cute. They are. They are. You cute. love them? I'm really worried, man, <laughs> about where you're going. You care about them? Yeah. You care about them? They mean yeah. a lot to you. You got a familial bond. That's thick. Oh, you, that's thick. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know it was the? No. I watched. You went for that so fucking confidently, man. And I was like, "Wow, he's really committing to this bet." <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, no, they're great though. They're really. They're oh, really I have funny. a condition I have to tell you about since you took a sip from that. Are you serious? No. <laughs> Dude, she's got. She's You're really got good all, at that. She got all three of You're us. You're really good at lying yeah, to she people. She got all three of us in <clears throat> different lies. Jesus Christ! Wow. Here's what I used to do at Halloween. I used to give out candy with, with razors razor in them. Yeah. I used to. I used to put razors in them, or sometimes edibles. I'd put my own drugs in it. Yeah, you put. Yeah, edibles. that I purchase. I'd be like, yeah. I'd spend these three hundred dollars yeah. to make edibles and just hand them out to kids because that yeah. makes a lot of sense, and mm -hmm. that's why parents should be scared this Halloween, this October. <laughs> that, <laughs> Susan, <laughs> Susan, there's yeah. a Susan out there. There's a Susan. Maybe there's a. Do you know anyone under the age of forty named Susan? No. I know I know no. Susie, but that's it. No, I'm not asking about Susie. I don't know. I mean, maybe her like legal name was Susan. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Charlie. I didn't mean. No, it's fine. Oh, now I feel bad. No, it's fine. Bro. Oh man, no, it's okay. you, you're you're the light of my life. It's all right. You're the light of my oh. life. Next recording, I'm and gonna, I, and I, gonna and bring I... in my Prismarine Drago, <laughs> dual modded out. See how you do. Is that a Beyblade? <laughs> yeah, no, I made it up. It sounded like a Beyblade. Prismarine Drago? <laughs> <laughs> just dragon oh. with the N omitted? I got a little myself. dribble. Just a little, a little dribble going man, on. Man, you, you must feel like such a such an idiot. These have been rough, rough podcasts for me so yeah. far, huh? Yeah. yeah, these have been rough. So you're in L.A. Yes. You live in L.A. You moved from the East Coast. Do you like it better here? Um, I have friends here, so it's, you know, better for that reason. Yeah. But the actual place. I prefer New York. You like mm. waking up every morning and like, mm, smog. Okay, yeah, love that. Yep. Yeah, I do miss the piss in the streets, but yeah, dude, and the, or when the when the uh, garbage people go on strike. Oh, and they that's a good one. And then yeah. the trash piles up for a little bit. Isn't that what they used to do in like medieval times? They like threw shit out the window. They like threw piss and shit out. Yeah, they did. Yeah, the they did. They like went in the but gutters. But people out the windows too. Defenestration. Mmm. I don't know if that's what happened, but that's for I sure a word, and that's what it means. Oh, defenestrating people? Yeah. yeah. Why not? Mm -hmm. bring I also back? think we should bring Such duels a specific back, too. Ghouls? Duels. Oh. No, also Fuck, ghouls. you had me ghouls, excited ghouls for a second. I was never really I excited about I was For some reason, I was way more excited about ghouls than the concept of duels. Uh, I am also excited about ghouls, north north though, north though, okay. too. Now okay. that you mention it, I'm here for both. But, like, duels, yeah. I mean, like, who was that... Uh, Josh is in, in the room. Who was that president that just kept dueling people in the, in the, in the Oval Office? Was there a president that did that? Yes, I don't I'm know. trying to Wilbur remember. told me about this recently. It's probably a Jackson. Yeah. Who was the president that kept the? I think it might be. Office? It was probably a Jackson. I think it might. No, be. we did have a lot. The it's dueling president. That I don't was, know. That is a thing. I just know that, like you know, in, for some reason, hey, hey, is is Josh out? Josh. He's in the bathroom. I need him to answer a question right this instant. Borif, maybe you please. We need him. We need him. Oh, oh my dude. god! It's a, yes. a specific American. Hey everyone, history not question. just Emma. We have another special guest here on the episode today. Oh right. I was outside for five minutes and I asked, "Can someone come open the door? It's locked." And I found that it was cool for my question. 
Oh no. Connor was locked out for five minutes. Well, I don't know if anyone heard that, but Connor was locked out for five minutes because he, he did the, the uh, yeah. push instead of pull. So this is Garfield. He was damp this morning, real damp. Real and nothing damp. else was damp. We don't know why. It was weird because there's no dew in LA. No, we've established, but apparently. he was he was like wet, but not everywhere. Just Up like here in the hills, it can get it moist the because the clouds. What? And if you're up, if you're high up in the hills, no it can get moist because the clouds. That's where they put the data. That's true. That's where they put the data. Yeah. That's where they put the data. That's where all my Google Google photos. <laughs> 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 That's where they Google 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 Let's stick on L.A., though. Why is it such a terrible place with bad yeah. people? Oh. Why can nobody fucking drive properly here? Can we talk about that? These so are the I, worst, most insane drivers I've seen in my life. <laughs> I've <laughs> almost killed the <laughs> passengers of my vehicle you. twice. You're talking about yeah. You. Yeah. Yeah. There are times, like, I have this term with, with Shay, the GF, that um, whenever it's past 9 p.m., mm -hmm driving in LA we like to call that crazy hour because <laughs> that is when I've noticed a significant uptick in people just like be it becomes like speed racer and they go like in between mm -hmm. stuff or I, one thing I noticed in LA is that people really think that they can make the exit no matter how yes. late they notice yes. that the exit is there that's so the New Jersey exit that's straight up just a thing that you just you just cut the line and then try and get in at no, the I'm end. No, I'm talking like no, no. I'm talking like you're in the middle lane and like oh my exit is there in 50 feet. I'm oh, gonna cross three lanes yeah, and go into the yeah. 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 yeah yeah yeah. And it's mm. usually like almost they actually it's almost always turns. a Prius. They do with all turns, not even just exits. Like they'll just fucking go for it. Bro. Yeah. They do mm. a hail mary and they just fucking send it. And it mm. works like 50% of the time. Yeah. You know, Schlott, you do this, and you've gone from, it's funny because you used to be a really aggressive driver when yeah. I was with you before. <clears throat> and now you're still a really aggressive driver, but you apologize for it. Like, regularly? Well, listen, because you get uncomfortable when I'm in the car. <laughs> yes! You get, every time Most I do some, would. every time I do something bad. Which is a Charlie's lot. like, oh, God, dude. I do, I do not say yeah, that. You're like, oh, I do not say that. Oh, I maybe maybe I make a face when you like go from zero to sixty. Well, listen, for the I rent the Tesla. Time. It's a fun time. I sometimes hit the tap on you the gas. You accelerate and brake to the beat. I did that songs. last time. It is like every on time Schlatt rents a Tesla, he's like, oh, did you know that the Tesla's acceleration is really quick and it's like literally Instant everybody. I get the gas down. When, it just when goes. a song is on that you like and the beat, like the drop is coming up, I put my head and neck against the back of the seat because yeah. I. Know you're going to fucking speed up. You just sound boring. like like they're just we're just describing you, and it just sounds like you are just an irresponsible person. No, no, no. That didn't sound. Sincere. Yeah, that was kind of all. Huh? Yeah. No. no, but I like that you're saying sorry for it now. Well, I mean, he's just saying I no. He's not providing any evidence to def like, no, refute that's, it. It's that's, just. That's, I, mean, I have a theory. Any... Look, I think people who drive or learn to drive on the East Coast, they know how to drive. They're just assholes. But I think people on the West Coast and maybe even Texas, like the West side of the country, they just don't know how there to do is, it. There yeah. is they don't a know how to do it. Bit of a lack of, uh, mm. you know, yeah, you know. I mean, I'm sorry, but it's just it's it's true. It's it is. I will say the one I thing. Uh, growing up in Virginia, the one thing as soon as that little flake of snow falls, as soon as people see it, like their fucking eyes, you know, the blood seeps in. They start like yeah, making man. turns they <laughs> never would before. It, like it hits their windshield and they start oh, 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 and just absolutely veer <laughs> off into an exit. Just reverts to, <laughs> it's to it monkey. was it is fucking nuts in Vermont. Um, how it is now is a lot of people like you know they have winter tires. They've got trucks. A lot of it is just like back roads that are 50 mile an hour back roads, mm -hmm. and people will just get on them when they're fucking coated in snow, no visibility, and just be like, man, I'm sick, and just go as fast as they can without being able to see anything, like on these snowy roads. So there's there's something somewhere. The for state, the, the Northeast is prepared for it, though. That's the thing. So yeah, like, they you are. You have the winter tires they and are. shit, and people still are assholes about it. But like, it's if like it a different snows, kind of crazy. Yeah. If, if it's in, in the South or like the West or like the, like Texas, we're not mm -hmm. prepared at all. No. 
I moved in the day of that terrible snowstorm. Yep. Terrible As we've snowstorm. heard at there length. Was, there was like literally multiple podcasts. There was literally a couple inches on this of snow on the ground. Oh wow! On that that terrible day where people died and, you and eat, there was no power for a week. Beef jerky. Yeah, yeah. That's that happens in New York. You don't. There's not even a question as to whether or not school is out tomorrow. Oh yeah, no, you're not you waking least, up. You need yeah. at least a, a foot and a half in a order foot. to even consider the possibility. You need a foot. And it's not even that. It's not even that it needs to be a foot and a half. Like that shit needs to be falling at like midnight, and like it oh, needs yeah. to it needs to properly properly overwhelm oh, the snowplow yes. services oh, up until yes. the school is like, oh, they're it's not. Gotta gonna be have, it's just, it's, yeah, it's just gotta be sticking. It's just yeah. It's just gotta be a matter of like, can we prevent the can the snow prevent the teachers from getting to school yeah. or park and then that's it and how can we make sure it does yeah and like it's it's sitting in front of the tv the praying exactly the praying that you do when when the news i don't know why i don't know why they they gave the responsibility to like the news channels to announce what schools were closed well because the phones sometimes go down oh so here's the best feeling in the world man is going to bed that night knowing snow is coming and you wake up and there's like a foot outside, and your mom wakes you up, and she's like, "It's no school." And you're like, "Man, that yeah, just uh, that like the the what?" And it's funny you say that because it always is in that sort of gentle voice that yeah. you just did too. Yeah. Go back to bed, honey. Am I? Sorry, am I? Honey. Uh, no school. You guys man. are from North. What are you talking about? You, <laughs> they're not yeah. saying anything. They're laughing as if they understand, but they don't. Yeah, they don't. They really yeah, don't. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're not relatable. God. You ever fle- and Carter's from Georgia. He doesn't know what we're talking about either. Do you ever flush ice cubes? Yeah. Yeah. Jeez. The voice. <laughs> they all have the, for one moment, they all have the same voice. Yeah. Yeah, they're like. It's beautiful. In Hi. unison. Welcome. Welcome back to the land of living. <laughs> <laughs> no school. And I'm like, it's time to game. Yeah. It's time to game. It's time oh, to game. You slept in. <laughs> You're finally <Yeah>. awake. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys ever flush ice cubes down the toilet? What? It's yes. Like a, it was like a superstitious thing. I was gonna ask if you put a spoon under your pillow. Wait, for what? No, but I wore my pajamas on backwards. What? Okay, we're Back. getting further away Wait, from it, what I. No, I, these I, are rituals you would do to make it to ensure make, that to make school, school wouldn't school happen. Close? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. This You're, is cool. You guys ever just like rip there. your front tooth out and put it under the pillow? You know, school. Yeah. Dude, well, isn't it fucking crazy that there was a period of time where, like, every few months that we slide? were ripping teeth out? Oh, okay. No, no I wasn't going to let it slide. Okay, I wasn't going to let it slide. <laughs> I thought you were about to just go on to something. <laughs> no, no. I don't know if you guys ever, like, have a moment now where you're, like, brushing your teeth or something and you feel, like, a little wiggly. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> oh! <laughs> what? Schlatt just ripped ass on the podcast. I moved my foot off the table. It made a squeak. That's not a table. Mm. That's a chair. It's that's a booth, right. Actually. And, oh, my God, is that a booth? I did no other word. <laughs> I, d- I actually table. feel like they could do better than Booth. You think they could beat Booth? Mm-hmm. So, how about this one? Booth. Booth. Here's a question. Are you guys familiar with Boofing? Oh God. Boofing. I you shouldn't have said I, that. I don't. So here's the thing: is I used it very liberally as a verb. For a large period of time, uh, <laughs> conservatively, <laughs> "boof" means some whole and, something else, and you know. So I, I would frequently mess something up, you know. And I could be in the presence of my girlfriend or mom or whatever, and I'd say, "Oh shit, I boofed it." <laughs> and, <laughs> and isn't the word "biffed it"? No, no, no. I don't know because I said "boofed," and at it one is. point, someone um, said to me, "I was on a call," and they said. Do you know what boofing is? And I said no, and I didn't ask, and I haven't really used it since. Oh. That reminds me of the time that I. Um, what is boofing? Yeah, what is? You can still we don't know. So boofing is when you take a tampon no. and you soak it in no. alcohol and then no. put it inside um, your no. preferred hole of choice no. to get intoxicated. That doesn't work. You soak How? it up. Does that work? Yes, it does. <laughs> Oh, thanks, Bora. <laughs> thanks. thanks, Bora. Thanks, the, Bora. The number one boofer in the room, apparently. <laughs> Getting a fireball yeah, you, tampon you, you up in the ass all the night. Bora buddy. boofer. <laughs> He's doing it right now. You That's were how so I prepare quick every podcast. to confirm that, man. Oh my God. <laughs> boofer. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it, w- it works? I've never tried it. Oh. Yeah. yeah. I'm just wondering if it is effective. So I'm told. Gets rid of the, like, you don't have to chase with anything. No, you just you just soak it up, I guess. And like mm-hmm. I know people would do it in like high school to like get like, you know, sneakily drunk. 
Mm. Have, it's a very high school thing to do. Have you seen like the the that one way that um, vaporizing alcohol and just like breathing it in? Have you seen the, yes. the that on YouTube or some some dude? Yes, yeah, so you can that. technically seemed, smoke alcohol. Yeah, it seems super dangerous. <sighs> I just don't get it why. Seems like it upsets just you. Just take a shot. You're the one Shut who the was fuck saying up. Boof half your life. <laughs> I didn't listen, man. I like. I thought it. W- I it didn't really go where I was expecting it to. To be honest with you. One time I um, yeah. I didn't but know the meaning of a word where um I didn't. Of course, yeah. <laughs> I didn't know the meaning of the word trivial, and I was like, it was in college. Like I hadn't fully understood the word trivial for some reason. Like mm-hmm. my like sophomore year or something like that. I was asking a teacher a question about like some questions that would be asked on a test, and I referred to like a certain form of question as trivial. Oh. But I was like aiming for something as if it was like, is this as important as the other questions, or will this like show up more likely? That's kind of it. Sort of is. What but it, is, it made it the way I phrased it. It made it sound like I was saying that I thought the teacher's questions were like trivial as in right. like doesn't oh, matter. like doesn't like matter. Fuck okay. you. like i came off as like this pompous dick that was like all right teacher you're trying to test me these questions are trivial i can answer these with my fucking mm. fucking lobotomized or i don't know <laughs> yeah my brain out of my head I'm trying to think if i have any words that like sometimes words will come to mind but i don't know what they mean so like i want to use them in a sentence but i don't know how or you say like a word a bunch of times and now it just doesn't make sense I get that off. for short one for short words. Off. Yeah. O F F. Why? O F F. Off. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna let you. Off. I'm. A, I'm a, off. I'm Shock. Gonna, Shock. Shock. Yeah. Two. Shock. Grimbly. Grimbly is a good one. It's a good, it's a good one. one. It, it yeah. makes perfect no, sense. Honestly, it does make sense. It I hate does make bowl. Sense. Bowl? Bowl. bowl. Yeah, bowl? You say, would, do you think bowl. you'd still call bowl. it a bowl? If like you had the bowl. chance to rename a bowl, what would you call it? This is it. You lock it in. You get like mm. one shot to change it. Because oh, you don't like bowl. I'd rather call it like a curved dish or some cur- shit. You'd call it a curved, curved, dish? curved it dish? It sounds better than bowl, bro. It fucking sounds... Like, if I'm put on the spot, like, I'm like... I Look, know. I don't fucking know, but like yeah, anything's right. better than bowl. Bowl. I know. It has that. You, oh, feel. I know. Okay. Ted's got a brain no. blast. Dop. 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 Would you like a plate or a dop? Dop. 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 A cereal dop. 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 I could fuck with dop. 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 <laughs> so Emma, <laughs> usually when we have people come on this podcast. Mm-hmm. I pass off this question to Charlie. So Emma. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, usually when we have people on this podcast, mm-hmm. we ask them this question, which is. It's the mm, loudest way you could be pouring that. Mm, it's the loudest mm, way you could be pouring that. Schlatt. You're on the Chuckle Sandwich podcast, yes. right? A Chuckle Sandwich is at the end of the day a sandwich. And we all, <laughs> most we all come scenic together. Route you could be taking. We to all come this. together to be a part of that, whether it be the mayo, the butt loaf, pieces of the bread, or in my case, the meat. Uh, now, Emma, why I like this, Charlie? Oh. This is like <laughs> for you. You run a healing center yeah. or Here, something. In your seat. <laughs> this is very healing for me. What would you say? And no pressure. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> what like get you in a cult or what would right you now. say piece of the sandwich that we are all in what piece do you find yourself this. as huh. dude 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 tell like a ghost in the room with tell, us what what's going on are you clairvoyant tell emma tell us yes what what piece? What piece? What piece? At piece. You're making. You're crying. <laughs> you're crying. I'm trying to pull. I'm trying to All pull right. forth. Yeah. I'm communing. Yeah. I'm communing. Hold my hand. Hold my no, hand. I'm good, bro. Come on. No. Yo, you'll no, feel it. Right. You'll feel it when you do. Hey. We all have feel to. It when you I do. can. I can hold him because I'm secure. You're safe. Your mayo spread. Emma. Yes. 
here in this place, what piece of the sandwich are you? I think I would be a good, like, crispy piece of bacon. Oh. Like, just some crispy oh. bacon. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> <laughs> this has never happened what? in the history of the podcast. This has never happened in the history of the podcast. Let it Charlie, just, let it come Charlie's through. hand is sweaty and is yeah. also, like, My hand is also extremely sweaty. I know mm. it. He's, like, squeezing my hand mm. at intervals, too. It's odd. Open Beautiful. it up. Open up the sandwich. Yeah. Let the bread open up. Peel back the layers. <laughs> This is Put the fault. bacon on. How many slices, Emma? Oh, I think a good four. Four, four. even, four. Solid. Wait, what's no! up? No, what, the how, circle how big is, is broken. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Did goodness. you not like my slices of bacon? No, the bacon was fine. Whatever the fuck this guy was doing was not. What has happened here cannot be undone. Okay, so that was an interesting iteration of that question on the podcast. Are you are you are you good? Are you? Yeah, just give me a minute. I killed them. I know. This cat smells really damp. This couch. He's been damp it all day. It smells damp. He's talking, you see, she's talking he really about retains, Garfield. He really retains moisture. Yeah, I could. I, okay, cool. So bacon is good. Okay. okay. Speaking of bacon. Oh my yeah. God, that's that's a good. Wow, that's re good. Reducing oh, it, reducing it, and re oh. you're reducing I mean, it. You I like totally bacon? did that subconsciously. You like bacon? I enjoy a good crispy piece of bacon. Okay. Would you rather have unlimited bacon? <laughs> but no more video games? Oh, here it comes. Yeah. Do you want to, we can join hands oh, again if you Jesus. want. Are you strong enough to do this alone, man? It's your back. You're really looking for some oh, human God. connection oh, right God. now, and I don't understand where this is what it used to be. Come <laughs> from. No, I'm not, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> dude, it's Would fun. you rather have what? unlimited bacon but no more video games? Or would you rather have games, unlimited games, but no games? That was the most flawless execution of that question you've ever done in the history that of the podcast. That was very Thank you. I'm very I'm proud. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Man, you really didn't mince words that As time. As an avid chuckler, I'm familiar. I'm familiar. An avid chuckler? Well, I, yeah, wow. I actually didn't mention this. Yeah, I'm a stan. <laughs> You're a stan? <laughs> <laughs> What's the answer to the question so I can leave? You're not a st No, What's Emma, you're not a stan anymore, okay? Stan. You're bacon. So bacon. tell us. I'm bacon. <laughs> what, would you, <laughs> what, would you, what would you rather have? How can you, and here's a question, and th these two questions are connected almost, because how could you be bacon, but then also not choose on bacon? Be bacon. bacon. Mm -hmm. be a bit well, mm -hmm. I did mention earlier that I do not value myself. Okay. Ooh. So that also. Maybe not a good note to end it out on, but for sure. But then no games. No yes, games. But, no, but unlimited, unlimited games. But important to note, no games. Unlimited, games. but none. I just kind of realized something. There's What's two ways that you can say no games. It could mean two things. Ted, I just realized something. This question doesn't make any fucking sense. <laughs> no, no. Shut the fuck up. I'm sorry. Asshole. How dare you? As I was saying. Because um, people could be saying like... It's okay, dude. Could, could say no games. Like, I don't want to... I don't, I don't want to... Healed. I don't want to be playing any games. Like, I don't want to be messing around. Right. Or video games. So that's a little piece of information I discovered right now. All right, you're gonna behave. It's totally not what the question was asking though. You it's behave, totally Schlatt. Talking about video bacon games. Bacon can be a verb. Colloquialism. Colloquialism. Yeah, the narwhal bacon's at midnight. That's a classic. What phrase. the fuck are you talking about, dude? What? This, no, say it again. No, say it again. The the what? <laughs> the narwhal bacons at midnight? Is that one of what those, the, is that one of those animated videos where it's like the song? <laughs> no, this is just the mantra every Redditor repeated until like 2012. Oh. Ooh, did you did you just raise your hands up in the air like violent? <laughs> <laughs> you, you get it? They fucking got it. You would. Oh my god. It was it because was it bacon reader? It was somebody on Redditors. <laughs> somebody on Reddit so was stuck they in an just airport <laughs> and was trying to find other Redditors. So they just went up to people. And said the, the oh. Yeah. So if you're ever in a, if you're ever in a, at midnight, at midnight, oh! the bacon's, at oh. bacon's at midnight. Wow. Tumblr had their own version of that. What was that for Tumblr? 
I think it was like I like your shoelaces or something. That's like, like that. normal. Not That's as like good. Not as good. Yeah. Not as good. No. And so like, if you <laughs> came up to me and said the narwhal bacon's and started like <laughs> gesturing at me to yeah. me to, I'd fucking run. Dude. Okay. Oh my goodness. I would run. Especially at a fucking airport, you're like, dude, this is about to. Be, <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm calling. Cool. Yeah, I'm calling TSA. Like, <laughs> yeah. It's like, is, so, the air, is the normal going to bacon right here, right now? <laughs> I'd rather it not. So the, the question, though. Yeah. Unlimited bacon. Yeah. And no games. Yeah. Or unlimited games. Yeah. But no games. No, yeah, games, no games. Unlimited games. So but games. But no, unlimited games, but, but no, no games, more games. But no games. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Make Consider your, choice, your options your choice, carefully, your choice, Emma. Make a choice. Make a choice. Choose a choice, wisely. The choose floaters, wisely. The make, make a choice. What did they say? What did you say? Family of three. Make a choice. <laughs> 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 I think I'm 405 <laughs> last night at 9 32 p.m. Murder. Oh. The, the, I guess I'm going to have to go with the bacon. She you went know with the bacon. That, you I know that means. You, you know what that means, though. Games. You know no what that more means. video games. games. No more video games. Yeah. Wow. But how can I be without myself? <sighs> That's true. That's true. Also, I? what would the narwhal do? At midnight. Bacon. Damn. Do it for the narwhal. Damn. All right. Well. I think the narwhal ever games at midnight. Shall I? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for. Not anymore. Um. Should we, well, well, hold on, <laughs> hold on. We, we we usually do this because it's the guest episode. Uh, thank you so much, Emma, for coming on the Chuckle Sandwich podcast. But now it's time to roll out the red carpet. Schlatt, you want to do the thing? We could skip it. What the fuck is wrong? We skip it. <laughs> we could. Where can people find you on the? What do you got going on? Where what do you got going? Like, you? like, where can people find you? Um, she makes funny tweets. Sometimes I'm on Twitter at Emma Longevin. And I don't do anything else. I'm just, I just got lucky. Yeehaw. You're funny. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thank you. Well, thank you so much for coming Thanks on. For coming. This was thank you. Thanks Emma for having me. Longevin. Watch Yeehaw. out for the Grimblies, everyone. Yes. They're coming mm -hmm. and they're in your. There's pants. actually one right. Oh, no.